black bears versus brown bears slash the differences between the black bears and brown bears it might be confusing to tell the differences between black bears and brown bears some characteristics can help you differentiate the two knowing these differences can help you make wise and safe choices in bear locations in this video we shall briefly discuss the top 15 differences between black bears and brown bears number one black bear scientific name versus brown bear scientific name the black bears belong to the species scientifically called ursus americanus while the brown bears are called ursus arctos number two black bears distributions versus brown bears distributions north american black bears are native only to north america you will never see a black bear outside the north american continent they are restricted only to canada the usa and northern mexico whereas brown bears have the widest distribution and geographical range of any bear species in the world they are found in europe asia and north america the world's largest brown bears are found in coastal british columbia and alaska in north america they are mainly found in alaska and western canada number three black bears habitat versus brown bears habitat black bears are found in a variety of habitat types they inhabit both coniferous and deciduous forests and also open alpines habitat types they are hardly found on great plains or wide open areas except areas with riparian vegetation and trees like black bears brown bears are also found in many habitats but they inhabit from the fringes of deserts to high mountain forests and ice fields in europe they are mostly found in mountain woodlands while in north america they are seen in the tundra alpine meadows and coastlines number four black bears height versus brown bears height brown bears are slightly taller than black bears a full-grown brown bear can measure up to 1.5 meters tall at the shoulder and when fully reared the biggest individual can take up to 3 meters the black bears cannot compete with these heights the maximum shoulder height of the black bears is 0 9 meters but can measure up to 2.1 meters when fully reared Number 5. Black Bear's Weight versus Brown Bear's Weight The size of the bears is a confusing and misleading factor in differentiating black bears from brown bears. This is because of the alteration of body size during hibernation periods. Like their height, brown bears are larger than black bears. The general body weight of fully grown black bears ranges between 150 kilograms and 300 kilograms while the body weight of fully grown brown bears ranges between 250 kilograms and 400 kilograms number six black bears facial profile versus brown bear facial profile black bears have slimmer sleeker necks they also have a straight Roman nose facial profile, while the brown bears have a thick ruff of fur around their faces and a concave or dished facial profile. Black bears have ears that stick straight up, they are more prominent than brown bears. While brown bears have shorter, rounded ears. If a line is drawn from the nose of the bears, it will be noticed that brown bears have a more concave face. Number 7. Black Bear's Claws 
versus brown bear's claws. Black bear's front claws are shorter, at a length of 3 to 5 centimeters, and more curved, like that of a cat's. The claws are a good adaptation for climbing trees and tearing apart stumps and logs in their forest habitat. On the other hand, brown bear's front claws are longer and more straight, at a length of 5 to 10 cm. They are very useful for digging up roots or excavating burrows of small animals out of their holes. Have you gotten closer enough to observe all these? Number 8. Black Bear's Colors versus Brown Bear's Colors. Differentiating black bears from brown bears through colors can be confusing and misleading because the two bear species have a diverse shade of colors. Black bears take many hues of brown and even shades of blue and white. While brown bears' colors range from dark brown through light blonde. Their colors may even appear black. Number 9. Black Bear's Shoulder Hump versus Brown Bear's Shoulder Hump. Another distinguishing factor between black bear and brown bears are the shoulder hump and the rump. Brown bears have a prominent shoulder hump and the rump is lower than the shoulder hump, while black bears have no distinctive shoulder humps and the rump is higher than the front shoulder. The humps of the brown bears are a mass of muscles and bone structures that help brown bears in digging. It also enhances the speed of brown bears in catching moose cats or caribou cats for food and could enable the use of their paws as a powerful force. Number 10. Black Bear's Tracks versus Brown Bear's Tracks. You can easily tell whether a bear is a black bear or a brown bear by looking at the bear's outside toe prints. In the left front foot track of a black bear, the claws are shorter and the toes are more separated and more curved. The front feet track measure between 10.16 and 20.32 centimeters long by 8.26 and 15.24 centimeters wide. The hind feet track measure between 2.7 and 22.86 cm long, by 8.89 cm and 5.24 cm wide. This shows that the black bear's front feet are more rectangular than the hind feet. On the other hand, brown bear tracks are similar to the black bear but larger. In the left front track, the claws are longer and the toes are more closely separated and more curved. The front foot track measures between 7.78 and 33.02 cm long by 12.7 and 22.23 cm wide and 20.95 and 35.56 cm long by 12.07 and 21.59 cm wide for the hind tracks. Their claws are also generally longer than that of the black bears. The heel pad of the front foot often does not show for either species. The negative space between the toes is filled with fur. Number 11. Black Bear's Climbing Ability versus Brown Bear's Climbing Ability. Black Bears are expert climbers. Their short, non-retractable claws are built for climbing this enables them to run up a tree, with ease and incredible speed. Their claws, are short, rounded, thick at the base, and taper to a point, but not sharp for holding prey. The two hind and two forelegs, are almost the same in length, but the four claws, are more sharply curved. All these great resources, help them to latch onto the bark of trees, and to climb up high. On the other hand, brown bears are not excellent climbers, like black bears. Fully grown adult brown bears are not good at climbing trees because of their size and weight. 
apart from their size and weight, fully grown adult brown bears, have claws that are long, and sharp. These make it hard for them to climb. They also have a fixed wrist joint, with paws that turn inwards. All these body structures, weigh against the ability to climb. However, grizzly bear cubs, are excellent climbers. Number 12. Black bear attacks, versus brown bears attacks. Generally, both black bears, and brown bears, seldom attack humans on sight. They usually avoid people, however, they can attack when surprised, or feel threatened. According to documented statistics, the number of black bear attacks on humans, is higher than that of brown bears. This is because the black bears, outnumbered the brown bears, not because they are more aggressive. It has been noticed, that startled black bears run away, often to a tree, whereas startled grizzlies, may charge and occasionally attack, making grizzlies much more dangerous than black bears. Number 13. Black bears populations, versus brown bears populations. In terms of populations, black bears, are much more in numbers, having currently about 800,000 individuals, while brown bears have only about 110,000 individuals. Number 14. Black bears hibernation, versus brown bears hibernation. Hibernation, for some animals, is the strategy evolved for coping with the harsh season of winter. Both black and brown bears hibernate, but they have a slight difference in the time spent in hibernation. Black bears, hibernate for up to seven and a half months without eating food, drinking water, or even defecating, while brown bears grizzly, typically hibernate between five and seven months. Number 15. Black bears tails, versus brown bears tails. Both black bears and brown bears, have tails. They are born with tails, but their tails, are shorter compared to their body length. Typically, the tail of black bears, measure up to between 7.7 cm and 17.7 cm in length, while that of brown bears, measure up to between 6 cm and 22 cm in length. Thank you for watching. Did you enjoy our top 15 differences, between black bears and brown bears? Let us know by leaving a comment below, and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos. See you in our next video.